Jesus is still touched with the feelings of your infirmities. And he's still here among us. By spirit, I want you to just open your heart up to him. Let him touch your life. Let him heal you right now. Those who believe and say, I believe God's word is still the same, and I expect a miracle today. said to herself if I can touch but his clothes I know I will be whole she pressed through the crowd from behind she touched his clothes her blood began to dry she knew she'd receive the miracle she needed that day The centurion with the servant who was ill Heard Jesus had the power to make him well And he said to the Lord If you'll just speak the word I know my servant will be healed Jesus said, go your way as you believe You will find your servant healed because you came expecting a miracle from me. And I expect a miracle today. I know nothing is impossible to those who just believe and say. still the same and I expect a miracle today you may feel you're at the end of your rope your circumstances don't provide you much hope but your heart says I know there's a way friend I know of an anchor secure The word of God will always stand sure And what he said he'll do If you'll just expect him to A miracle can happen to you So don't be moved by the things you see But look to Jesus and with your faith believe that Jesus is the same as he was yesterday and he works miracles for those who still believe as you speak his word and faith you will see your whole life begin to change because you came expecting a miracle today A miracle today I know nothing, nothing is impossible To those who just believe and say I believe, Lord, your word is still the same And I expect my miracle Today, I expect a miracle today.
makes the difference, doesn't it? I have a message from the Lord. Hallelujah. A message, oh my friend, for you. It's recorded in His Word. Hallelujah. Jesus said it, so I know it's true. What did He say? He said, Look at me. Jesus now and Gosh, it's recorded in his word hallelujah and it's only that you look and live now let me tell you what happened when this when this song came about brother in our church my pastor's brother Laid on the hospital bed, uh, on, on, on the hospital operating table and died. His heart exploded in his chest. Doctors came out and told us that we lost him after we had prayed and God had sent word through Pastor Benny that there would be no death. And he's dead with his heart outside of his body. No blood going through his system. Seven minutes lay dead as they come to explain to us that they lost him. His heart exploded. We sent the doctors back in there and told them God said no death. Laid hands on three Jewish doctors, sent them back in Oh, I'm about to explode here. I'm about to explode. <laughs> Laid hands on them, put oil on them, rubbed their hands down, sent them back in there. They said, no, you're, you're going through denial. No, we're not. God said, no death. He's not dead. Go back in there. Put his heart back in his body. They went and put his heart back in. They said they were just doing to find out what they may have done wrong because he was gone. Seven minutes, no blood, no oxygen, heart outside of his body on another apparatus put his heart back in, sewed all the things up, funneled blood back through the heart, nothing happened. Doctors put his hand down, pushed, and the blood in the heart started beating all by itself. <laughs> to make a long story short, he's a wonder, you know, to make a long story short, got back to church the next day, and you can imagine we had service like nobody else had. <laughs> and the song we sang, my pastor called me up, and said sing the song because he had died come back to life again so I said look at me come on now. my brother live look to Jesus now oh, 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 oh. it's recorded church right now it's all right <laughs> it's recorded in his word hallelujah and it's only that you look and believe hallelujah hallelujah hey Donnie Donnie come here come here now, now, remain standing please I want you to sing it one more time. I want the choir and the whole host of the Lord here to sing with you the, 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 that chorus that you just do. And sing that hallelujah part. Every time you sing hallelujah, man, that anointing just hits this place. So do it again. Oh, God have mercy here. Come on, sing. Look at me.
It's recorded in his word. We were gathering in this place in one accord. Already I felt a holy presence as we began to praise the Lord. But when I looked where you were sitting and I gazed into your face, I could see that you were struggling. I could sense your pain and, and so I've prayed Oh Holy Spirit May your glory fill this place Reveal to those who have a need The answers on the way Cause this is the night When your miracle happens This is the night when the lame shall walk again So believe and receive your healing In Jesus' name This is the night When God makes it right This is the night I've got good news there is a healing for you and for me. A healing that's already been purchased by the blood on Calvary. Tonight in this room there's healing for every sickness, every broken heart or pain. There's miracles of healing that this world will never explain. And so if you'll trust in Jesus And just believe this word is true Then you will receive the miracle He's already promised to you Because this is the night When your miracle happens This is the night When the lame shall walk again so believe and receive your healing in Jesus' name. This is the night when God makes it right. This is the night. And so be free from your diseases, from your sickness. 
sickness and from your pain because he'll break the chains that bind you and he'll cast them away so by the power of God is flowing you rise up and proclaim you say I'm healed I've been delivered it's in Jesus People said amen. My God, it's electric in this place. Why should I feel discouraged? Why should the shadows fall? Why? Should my heart be lonely and long for heaven and home when Jesus is He's my portion, my constant. His eyes on the sparrow, oh yes, and I know He watches me. And the second verse says, let not your heart be troubled, His tender word I And resting on my God's goodness, I lose my doubts and fears. Well, I draw him close to me from care. eyes on the sparrow yes and I know he watches watches me will I sing said I sing because I'm happy yeah. Well, I see Because I'm free oh, His eye is on the space I know he watches me. Will I sing? Because I'm happy, and I 
King's kids are out there. Praise God. Praise God. I am a child of the King. created in God's name. Every breath of God lives in me. Made with mercy, crowned with favor. Look around. Goodness and mercy follow me. Seed of Abraham, an adopted royalty. I'm a holy line. I am a special breed. I was made in His likeness, created in God's image. Every breath of God lives in me. of righteousness, a jewel in Papa's crown, a king, a priest, the apple of God's eye, heir of your father, joint heir with the son, and the riches of his kingdom are all mine, we're the salt of the earth, we're the light in this whole world, everything my father has, he's passed on to me, I'm made in his likeness, created in God's image, and the very been adopted, accepted, anointed, and appointed. We have authority as born-again believers. We're baptized, blessed, blameless, and blood-bought. We're the children of God. We've been called and chosen as citizens of the household of faith. We're dedicated disciples, delivered, and determined. To God, we've been encouraged and endued with power to hide. We're of his presence will be mine eternally 
Oh, the glory of his presence. Oh, the beauty of his face. I am his and his forever. He has won me by his grace. In the darkness, in the shadow, with the Savior I have trod. Sweet indeed have been those lessons since I've walked alone with God. I have seen Him and I have known Him, for He deigns to walk with me and the glory of his presence will be mine eternally oh the glory of his presence oh the beauty of his face I am here and he is forever. He has won me by his grace. Oh, it is Jesus. Yes. It is Jesus, it is Jesus in my soul, for I have touched the made me whole and his blood has made me whole and he touched Hands uplifted, sing it again with us. He Something happened. 
everyone pray everyone believe everyone pray Keep praying, saints. Keep praying. Keep believing. Keep praying. The mighty move of the Holy Ghost is about to hit this arena. Followed him down dusty roads wherever he would lead. The multitudes would gather as he healed each disease. With eyes of wonder, they would watch as he would stop to pray. And when he spoke, the word of faith you could hear them say here comes a miracle here comes a miracle oh can't you feel it oh can't you feel it in the air that look is 
His glory is in this place. I know a miracle is here. The lame could walk, the deaf could hear, and blinded eyes could see. And those who had been bound for years were suddenly set free. They came in desperation, the hurting and the poor. But when they saw him through the crowd, they knew what was in store. Here comes my miracle. Here comes my miracle. in our breath. Lord, we reach out to you and we receive your desire in our lives. And here today we follow him. We know his word is true. And nothing is impossible when he says he will do. And though the world may doubt us and though they laugh and stare Someday all men will see the truth when we meet him in the For 16 years to 1986. And then one night, when I was away preaching in a meeting, the devil came and 
an enemy trying to attack our home. <laughs> and the devil told me and my wife, that's it. You'll never make it again. You'll never rise above it again. That's said, can I do what I feel led of God yes, to do? Yes, please. Come up here, baby. You gotta forgive me for a minute. The devil said, You'll never make it, didn't he, Pat? He said, You'll never make it. You'll be destroyed. You'll be defeated. But he's alive. Patty was home alone that night by herself. I was away. Police officer came to the door, realizing that my wife was home by herself. Didn't want to give her the terrible news. But later on, a friend came to the house and took her to the emergency room. She sat there in that emergency room while nurses went in and out and in and out, and nobody came to tell my wife what had happened to my boy. And she sat there in that room. And I was away, and I'd already got the news. My heart was broken. And suddenly a coroner walked across the room in that emergency ward in that hospital, looked at my wife and said, your boy is dead. The devil took hold of our lives and tried to ravage it. But I'm here to tell you tonight, greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. There is no power. There is no devil. There is no demon. There is no force from hell that can defeat you. We're alive tonight because he's alive. Come on, shout it at him. He's alive when he tries to make you think that you're a papa. When he knows himself, you're a child of a king. The mighty shield of faith for the battle is already won. We know that Jesus Christ is risen and the work's already done. So just praise the Lord. He can work with us who praise Him. Don't you stop. Don't you stop. Don't you stop praising the Lord God in the heavens. Praise. Praise the Lord. Come on. 